Hey guys, welcome back to another edition of Tool Tech Tuesday. Tonight we have some Popo Man products or Popo Man. Uh, you guys decide on how you want to pronounce it. It's P O P O M A N. Uh, I'm saying Pope. Uh, Popo Man or Popo Man, um, not really sure uh, how to pronounce it. It is a, uh, a foreign company. This stuff is available on Amazon. They have a ton of tools to offer from uh, a six and a half inch polisher to a four and a half inch angle grinder to impacts to drills to impact drivers, uh, sanders. They just have a slew of stuff to offer. So check them out. Links in the description for their Amazon store. If you guys want to go check them out, they are also available on Facebook and you can also find them on Instagram. So once again, it's Popo Man or Popo Man, you decide. So uh, we're going to start off with the six and a half inch polisher and see what's all inside this box. Then we'll go ahead and move on to the four and a half inch angle grinder and see what they have to offer inside this one. Like I said, first off, we're going to go ahead and start with the six and a half inch polisher. Go ahead and get it unboxed and see what comes inside the box right off the bat. Everything is in a nice carry bag, which makes this nice and portable so you can take it anywhere really gonna have your manual a yellow pad a black pad some microfiber a handle a wool pad the tool itself a charger a handle and some tools and a battery and there is one more pad in here and it is the orange pad this is a 4 amp hour it does come with a 4 amp hour battery it is a 20 volt brushless unit um, I have not charged this battery up because I'm just now opening it up so um, We'll go ahead and later on down the line, this only has two bars. It does have indicators on the battery so you can see what your charge is like. Uh, so we'll go ahead and get this charged up later on down the line and uh, see how well it works. It is, does have a variable speed roller on the back side. One thing I will say is the orbiter is Pretty noisy if you had to run this for a long period of time. Um, I think you would get tired of hearing it, to be quite honest with you. It is 1,500 to 2,000 uh, pulses per minute as far as the orbital portion. Um, it does come with two different types of handles, whatever you so choose, so choose to use. Uh, you can have just a single handle on the one side, or you can have the D handle period per se on top that way you can put some good pressure on it if you need to if you're cutting in some bad paint like i said it does come with a black pad a yellow pad a orange pad and it also has a thin little wool pad with it plus microfiber uh, the head or the unit already comes with a velcro head on it it does have a trigger lock i'm just sitting here playing with the tool itself um, I don't know. It, it I don't know. It, it, um, you guys want to check it out? Make the decision on yourself. Uh, to me, it's pretty noisy. Um, I don't know if I'd be able to handle hearing that the uh, the whole time I'm using it. So, anyway, this is the six and a half inch polisher from Popo Man or Popo Man. It is a 20 volt brushless machine with a four amp hour battery that comes with it. Um, I don't know, I'm kind of undecided on this. I'm kind of anxious to try it out and see how well it works. Um, see if after a while the orbital portion breaks in a little bit and it's not as noisy. Um, I don't know, I'm kind of, kind of undecided as far as this one. So let's go ahead and move on to the grinder and see what all comes in that box. All right, this is the four and a half inch angle grinder. We're gonna go ahead and unbox it. This is a little bit more in my wheelhouse than the polisher. Not that I haven't done some detailing on cars before, but I'm not that much into the polishing aspect of stuff. Um, I'm more into the fabrication. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up, see what comes in the four and a half inch angle grinder box. Start off with your manual. 
It also comes with a battery charger. Got a handle for the tool. Got the tool itself. A guard. Your battery. And, ah, oh, cool. And they even sent some. Two grinding stones. And three death wheels. I call them death wheels, they're cutting wheels. These are the eighth inch or 16th inch cutting wheels. Um, I don't particularly care for these, but they do get the job done. What I don't like about them is if somebody is using them with you and they happen to set the tool down hard and it busts or chips it, um, those can come off and come right out at you. But I do use them. Um, and I do use them a lot, so just gotta be careful using these. So, uh, quite a bit of stuff that comes with this. It does come with the grinding guard, and then it does come with what I thought was pretty cool. Uh, after I unbox it here, here's your grinding guard and here's your cutting guard. So, uh, to alleviate the problem I just told you about with the uh, the death wheels, they will. Uh, this will save your butt uh, and keep that from sticking in your arm, your face, your neck. Uh, if it comes apart, so I thought it's probably pretty cool that they sent the uh, the cutting guard with it also. Same thing. This is a 20 volt brushless machine or brushless tool. It does have a 4 amp hour battery that comes with it, uh, along with the charger. Um, we'll go ahead and put this together. Four and a half inch angle grinders is something I can never have enough of. I can have a cutting wheel in one, I can have a flappy wheel in one, a regular grindstone in one. Um, something that's pretty cool about this, they put the handle, or the tool, right in the handle, so you always have it whenever you need it. So I thought that was a pretty cool concept, and I just put that on the wrong side. That sounds a heck of a lot better than that polisher did. Headlock button is on the back, right on top. You do have a thumb roll trigger, which is pretty nice. You don't have to sit there and hold it the whole time. That right there, that's handy. I would say, if you listen to the sound of that, these wheels are pretty cheap and unbalanced. Um, it really is throwing the, uh, the shaft off quite a bit. Um, so I don't know that I'll use these at all. Um, but it was nice that they do put it in the kit in case you do not have them. Has three different places you can put your handle, either side and on top if you wish. All right, once again, these are the Popo Men or Popo Man products. Um, first impressions, not 100% certain about the six and a half inch polisher. Um, as far as the grinder, um, it's not something I would not use. Um, uh, it does have a lot of resemblance to um, the Milwaukee cordless, the 18 volt. Uh, and it does have a lot of resemblance to my um, Dewalt. So uh, it will be handy to have another grinder that um, I can have on the bench hanging to either have a flappy wheel in it or a cutoff wheel in it um, or a grindstone in it. Uh, now I will have one of each to be able to use uh, how I choose. So uh, it's going to be kind of handy to have. Uh, another grinder. That would be interesting to see 
how it lasts, what the battery life is, and uh, yeah, if it can stand up to uh, my view. So I am also going to use the uh, polisher also. We got a new project out in the driveway that I have not showed you guys yet. So I'm going to try it out on that. So until then, that's pretty much all I have. Uh, batteries are interchangeable with each other. Um, so it makes it nice that I have... two batteries for the grinder or two batteries for the polisher if you go off-site uh, and doing some um, detail work to a vehicle off-site. So anyway guys, that's pretty much all I have for this week's Tool Tech. Um, if you don't mind, hit that like button, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you have not already done so. Check them out. Links in the description for their Amazon store. We'll see you guys in the next one.